Hey everybody, this is Connie, and I thought I would do a um, mukbang video for you today. I know that um, this light lighting isn't very good. I moved my living room around a little bit, so now I have a wall behind me. And there's Bud, come to say hello. Um, and my light is up here, so... When I do my mukbangs, I do them on my um, laptop. So we're just going to have to go for it. There, there's a good picture of my boy. Hey, bud. <laughs> anyway, um, I stopped at Culver's before I came home. I went to the doctor and I'll talk to you about that and I got some uh, mashed potatoes and gravy that are thick as you know what and then I got six piece shrimp and it has got a lemon slice which I am going to squeeze onto my shrimp. Ooh, it's squeezing squirting every place but on my shrimp. All right. Now that I have it all over my cuts on my hands. Anyway, I got my little Christmas tree up yesterday. Moved my furniture around. I kind of like this better. Um, I like the angle better. I can see outside better. I can actually see my TV better than I could and stuff. So. Anyway, there's my shrimp. This normally comes with french fries, but I ask, always ask for mashed potatoes and gravy. Anyway, I've been having such shoulder pain. Um, in 2010, I had... I had had a lap band and I had it removed in 2010 because it was causing all kinds of trouble and I had a huge hole in my belly from the lap band that it had corroded and eaten into my stomach. Ever since then I've had problems with my shoulder. But um, you know it's been really off and on all the time. The la this week ha has been excruciating. I have been in, and I'm off all week, and of course I've been in such pain that I can't even enjoy my time off. So anyway, I went to the doctor today. I broke down and said, I've got to go to the doctor. I can't stand this anymore. So he thinks it's referred pain, which I don't really understand what that means because he snake. He talks to me and then he leaves. He says I'll be back and then he never comes back. The nurse comes back. So I couldn't ask him what referred pain means. I'll have to look it up. He said usually when you have shoulder pain like that, it's usually in the right shoulder and it's caused by gallbladder. Well, mine is in my left shoulder. It hurts, and then when it hurts like that, it hurts to take a breath. It hurts when I sneeze or when I cough or when I burp, anything like that. It, it There's a sharp pain. And it hurts so bad, no matter how I move or lay or, or sit or stand or whatever, the pain doesn't let up. So what's he do? He gives me cream for the pain. Now, to put on there four times a day. I guess I'll see if it, if it helps. But I honestly don't think it's going to. And he told me to start taking my, you know, it could be my stomach, it could be my GERD. Um, so I've got to start taking my um, omeprazole twice a day instead of once. We'll see. I know I can't stand much more of this pain. 
and I'm kind of a tough cookie. I can take the pain. Not this pain. It's pretty bad. For a person that doesn't like fish, I do like shrimp. Breaded shrimp. And I love mashed potatoes, but their mashed potatoes kind of leave something to be desired. They're a little lumpy, and they're always too thick. Sorry for the mess beside me. This is my purse. And I've always got coloring books and stuff sitting beside me in my phone. Anyway, this is my new haircut I got a week or so ago. Um, I need to color my hair pretty bad. I don't know if I'm going to get it done this week or not. Because uh, Thursday I'm going over to my mom's for dinner, for Thanksgiving. Then Friday I'm going over there and I'm going to clean for her and I'm going to do some laundry. So. She can't vacuum. She can't do any of that stuff anymore. So I go over there and do it. I hate cleaning my own house, but I go over to her house and do it. But then I get to do my laundry for free, too. And she'll have me do other things, too, that she wants to be have done. really good. I was going to get a Frisco burger at Hardee's, which is right next door to Culver's. But I didn't really feel like having a burger, so. What's going on, bud? What's going on? What you doing, buddy? Hmm? I think I got totally confused him when I moved my furniture around. He doesn't know what to do now. But that's kind of his new spot. He likes to lay on the back of that couch. I haven't been doing much filming. I really need to. But I... I don't know. I guess you could say my depression's acting up again. Because I have no ambition to. Um, you know, I've, I've got like... Seven, eight, nine videos that I could do. That I have planned out. That I can do. And I don't want to do them. I will. I'll get my ass up tomorrow and do them no matter what. I've got my furniture moved around, like I said, and it's been so long since I dusted. I need to. I took everything off my, my bookshelves. And I'm going to clean those so everything is sitting right where I would film my coloring otherwise I would do a coloring video tonight but I'm not moving everything <laughs> but I really like this angle that I've got my chair at now I don't even know what to talk about. Working at a college, we're on Thanksgiving break. When the kids are on break, we're on break. So I have a week, a week now. I go back to work on Monday. Then for Christmas, I'll have two weeks off. Then I'll have spring break for a week. 
and then it, and the end of May or the beginning of June, whenever, then I'll have my summer off. I'll have three months off. So I don't know if I want to try to find a... Because I can draw unemployment. So I don't know if I want to try to find a, a part-time job or just draw my unemployment. If I could draw full unemployment, which would be like $220 a week or something, I could make it. And working there, you have a, a go-back-to-work date. And if it is less than their requirement, um, I wouldn't even have to do job searches, which is awesome. Because why would I want to do a job search if I already have a job? And you can't turn nothing down or else you'd lose your unemployment. I don't know. I'm kind of disappointed in that doctor. I don't know whether I need to find a different doctor. Because I just think he doesn't know what to do with me. I at least thought that he would um, x-ray my shoulder or do an ultrasound, you know, do a gallbladder ultrasound or something. Nothing. Gives me some salve. I don't know. I've been going to him for years and I love him to death. But that could be just because he's so dang friendly, you know. Not that he's a terrific doctor. I haven't been watching any other mukbangs. The one mukbang just drove me absolutely nuts because she chomped on her food and it was kind of disgusting. She'd burp and it's not Coke, it's Pepsi, but it'll do. Buddy, what are you looking at? He's so damn cute. <laughs> I love that cat, that cat very much. Sip one. I sleep here. Because I can't lay flat. So I sleep in this chair. And if I ever roll over onto my back, he's laying on my chest. And that drives me crazy because he wakes me up every time. i got to get some relief in the shoulder. That's all there is to it. Maybe doubling up on the Omel Prozole. Because I really have a feeling it has got something to do with that hole in my stomach. And I'm almost wondering if I have an ulcer or hiatohernia or something. But it's a little harder to breathe.
If any of you ever had referred pain before, if you did, tell me about it, would you? I am done eating. I am putting this back in the fridge. And I'll finish it later because if I eat too much at a time, then it kills me. It hurts so bad I can't stand it. But if I eat a little bit at a time, then it's not as bad. So I will talk to you guys very soon. Buddy and I say see you later. Bye.